Hello YouTube, this is Explosive Luke and today I am doing a mod showcase on the ninja mod. Basically this mod adds a couple extra weapons, items, armor, um, uh, mobs and food and it's overall it's a very good mod. Um, let's get straight into the recipes. So first of all it has the shuriken. Now that's just four iron cropped in a square on an angle or circle. And they have the same damage as a fully drawn back bow. Um, and right clicking them instantly throws them. So they're pretty good just spamming everything a little. Um, next we have a dagger. This has slightly less damage than an iron sword and lasts a tiny bit less. Um, I'll show you the dagger. See it's not quite as powerful as the iron sword but it's, it's still a good weapon. Um, then we have the katana which is just a stick then an iron ignit and a iron rod and an iron rod is just crafted like three iron on top of each other which gives you the katana and the katana has slightly more damage than an iron sword oh sorry it has the same amount of damage as an iron sword except it lasts a little bit longer then next we have the kunai which has the same damage as shuriken but i think they'll be fixing it oh sorry that was the hook oh, sorry um sorry this is the kunai it has about the same damage as the uh, shuriken, but I think in the future the mod creator will be changing it so it has more damage. Um, next we have the hook, which is what I just threw before. That's just a sh uh, kunai with two string under it, and that just works as you guessed probably you could guess before as an ender pearl. So you just right click to throw it, and you teleport. And it's pretty useful if you can't get, if you're not, if you can't find any endermen to kill, just craft these hooks. And I personally love this mod because of the hooks. I think it's great. And next you have the Sei, which is just a stick and free iron. That's the same damage as a dagger, I think. I believe. Yep. And then you have poison, which is just crafted with four brown mushrooms, one red mushroom, and four spider eyes. And with this poison, you can add it to the end of a dagger, like so, to get a poison dagger. Now, a poison dagger works just like the dagger, except, as you can guess, it poisons its target, its victim, and it just adds a tiny bit of extra damage. Uh, next we have the, uh, sorry, next we have dark fabric, which can be crafted from two string, one leather, and one ink sack, or, as you probably saw before, when I kill, uh, when I kill one of these guys, Uh, sometimes you they drop them. They didn't just drop it just then, but I can tell you it, they will drop it sometimes. Um. Uh, with this dark fabric, you can create dark steel, which is just four dark four dark fabric, and four iron, and then coal in the middle to get dark steel. Now with this, you craft a uh, dark steel rod, which works like the iron rod, so three dark steel 
units on top of each other. And then for a katana, you just have a wooden stick, sorry, dark katana, a wooden stick, dark steel, and a dark steel rope. Now that, I believe, has the same amount of damage as a diamond sword, but slightly less durability, so it doesn't last as long. Um, and what you what you can also do with the dark fabric is create the ninja armor, which has the same amount of uh, protection as diamond armor, except it if so except it doesn't last quite as long. And this armor is pretty good. So because um. Because it is doesn't cost as much as diamond, it's not quite as good, but it still is it still protects you as much. It just doesn't last as long. Um next we have the fruits. And um we have this nigarizushi nigarizushi. Oh, I have no idea how to pronounce that. Um that's just crafted by putting a fish in a crafting table. And it just gets this. And Makazushi. Uh, you get that from killing squids. Um, which makes killing squids worthwhile. Um, finally we have these amulet. Now, you craft them all with dark steel on the corners, poison, and... For the amulet of stealth, you have a golden apple, amulet of jumping is a feather, amulet of tranquility is a gold nugget, and amulet of velocity is a sugar. So I'll show you what all these does. Amulet of velocity gives you speed, and basically what these amulets do is they you right click and you get a potion effect for one minute. And you can use this 64 times. And the, the amulet of stealth gives you invisibility for one minute. Um, the amulet of jumping, we can guess for a minute you have jump boost too. And finally, the amulet of tranquil tran amulet of tranquility gets rid of all your potion effects and buffs. And you can use that 64 times. So, this has been the Ninja Bug. I hope you enjoyed my mod review. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.